Hey, Nikki and Kevin, how are you guys doing today? Doing great, thank you. Hey, how are you? you? I'm I'm great. Thank you so much. Uh, what? Thank you for for this show. This is such a wonderful show for kids. And Nikki, I want to start with you because you started uh, your career at Nickelodeon as an intern, and in like ten short years, look at you now. This is amazing. Uh, how are you feeling <laughs> about you know how how far you you've come and this and giving us this wonderful show? Um, it's really surreal. <laughs> I still, I, I'm still waiting to wake up from this marvelous dream, to be honest. No, it's, it's, it's truly, it's truly a blessing. Oh, go ahead. <laughs> yes, I'm sure it is. And I want to know from you, first off, how, how did you come up with this idea for the show? Sure. Um, it manifested itself through homesickness, to be honest. So I, I, grew up, I was born and raised in, in Puerto Rico um, and went to Nickelodeon to start my career in animation. But, you know, 10 years, you you definitely get homesick a lot. And even though I, I get to see my family for the, for the holidays, there's certainly instances where I'm like, oh, I wish I was home. So through that homesickness, that's, that's how the elements of Santiago came about. I wanted to tell the story of this sort of Robin Hood of the high seas, a good kid who protects others, but all in this magical Latino Caribbean world. Yes, yes, it's it's so much fun. And Kevin, for you, uh, being able to voice this character, like th this is this must be first of all so much fun for you. Yeah, it is. It's an amazing experience and. I've been so, you know, grateful and so blessed to have an amazing crew with me as well. Not only filming the show was amazing, behind the scenes was amazing because nothing nothing stops, you know what I'm saying? Like everything is amazing, everything is super like marvelous. The crew is super supportive, super humble, there for me in every single moment. So, honestly, it's the best experience I've had so far and I'm super grateful and super blessed and super happy to have come this far and now this Friday Santiago season is coming out so that's another thing to wait for another thing you know to be super happy about oh for sure now I want to know from you I, I know kids love pirates they the, you know and, and the visuals on this are absolutely stunning but I want to know from you Kevin like when you were a little boy like were, was pirates your thing Everything was my thing when I was a little kid. I, as a little kid, I love to do everything. I love to go outside. I love to go on adventures. Um, I used to be like a living monkey, honestly. I used to climb everything, everything <laughs> I saw. I wanted to get, you know, on top of it, you know, to jump off of things. So I was a very energetic kid as a, I was a very energetic kid, like back then. And that memory like faded away out of nowhere. But now that I got this role of Santiago, everything hit me again. And that's how the energy of Santiago is so high and so vivid and so amazing. And so, you know, up there, because all of my memories came back and kind of like zoomed into Santiago. So Santiago, you know, really reminds me of my childhood because he loves to go on adventures. He loves to hang around with his friends. He loves to do many new things every day. He loves to be outside, loves to help out people. And that's what I love to do. Yeah, oh, that's fantastic. And I think a lot of kids like to do that, for sure. I think they can totally relate to him. Uh, Nikki, what's wonderful, too, about the show is that it's not just in English. It's, you know, there's Spanish. And, and I think that that's really important. Why did you decide, you know, to do it this way and, you know, to make sure that, you know, I think it's important to, for kids to be multilingual? Of course. Um, it really came down to, to authentic representation. I wanted kids especially kids who come from a from a home where they they alternate between spanish and english to see themselves on television um for for the adventure well santiago goes out in adventures for it to not slow down that this could be done in an organic way whether it's through using spanish words to command his magical pirate ship or whether it's being not only santiago but his friends and his family alternating between English and Spanish. So if there's somebody that says something in Spanish, you'd hear somebody else respond in English with basically a similar version of what they just said. So there's con context within the, the dialogue that would allow our audience to connect the dots and 
you know, start learning the language. Right. Oh, for sure. Yeah. I think it's, I think it's really good, especially when they're little, they can really grasp easier and get used to it. So Absolutely. I think it's a great idea. Yeah. Um, Kevin, I want to, uh, if you can give us a little bit of a hint, what kids can expect from the show and what kind of adventures Santiago and his friends go on. So what you could expect from the show is obviously Spanish, a bilingual show. You could expect many, you know, like crazy things to happen. He helps out many people every chance he has. He helps out the villains. He helps out the people from the island. He helps out his friends. He helps out anyone, even animals. Like he's the best character and that I know, and he has the best spirit. And it's amazing to know that he's going to, you know, embark many new things, face many new obstacles. And he's honestly a great kid. So what you guys can expect from the show is crazy, you know, like turns and crazy and crazy switches throughout the show and many new things to look forward to because I'm not only going to be going on the adventure at Santiago, you guys will be as well watching the show and putting yourself in his shoes and seeing what you guys would do as well. So honestly, it's all a team effort. Oh, that's amazing. Well, it's a great, it's a really is a great show for kids. And uh, I think they're going to really have fun watching it. I just want to thank both of you for your time today. And best of luck with uh, San Diego of the Seas. It's just so much fun. Thanks, guys. Thank, thank you very you, much. Man. Okay, have a great day. Bye bye.